three of the Minecraft Ark of the Challenge. Controlled, Controlled explosions, explosions with John. <laughs> well, welcome back to MHC. This is uh, episode three, day three. We are having some good fun with building the wall. Still, like last time. Yeah. <laughs> My friend Dennessy is here with me. Uh, Dennessy and I play on the Craft Theory server together. And uh, try an MHC for the first time. I uh, am down getting iron and coal. I just tried to fly. <laughs> How'd it work? <laughs> it went very well. I'm, I'm not... okay. I'm very clearly <laughs> flying around. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're we're a little short of the elytra right now. Yeah, but I'm used to just jumping off an edge and fly away. I miss my elytra. There's. I was playing. Um, have you ever played the mod pack roguelike adventures and dungeons? Uh, the mod? There's a, there's a, it's a mod pack by Dreams. Oh, it's a mod pack? I haven't played that. Um, but they, he has the Megaloot mod that uh, Skal did. And uh, one, one of the chest plates is the dragon chest plate. And it is basically, it's unlimited flat flight. I mean, it's basically like creative mode. And I was playing for a while, and then I'd come back and try to play like on Craft Theory or, or some vanilla Minecraft, and I'm like, but, <laughs> but I'm, I can't fly. <laughs> and you put yourself in these situations where, you know, if you could fly, it's not dangerous at all, but <laughs> it's suicide. <laughs> uh, that's basically what I did now. Ugh. Or not, not now anymore, but like. Oh, I found a, oh no, I was going to say, I found a, uh, <laughs> I was up really close to diorite and it looked like cobble, so I thought I was in a uh, spawner. Aww. But it's just that new diorite texture that I'm not used to. Could have been, should have been. I don't know, zombie spawners aren't all that fun. Yeah, true, but uh, easy experience points. Yeah. As sheriffs, we don't need no experience. No stinking experience, right? We just can have to hold the law with. Own two fists. Just using uh, our wits and democracy. There we go. And so oh, right. I'm gonna have tools for you and everything here very soon. That, that, those poor villagers are still stuck in the corners, aren't they? Well, they are this not too bright. He's, <laughs> he tries to pathfind, but he he's just stuck. I wonder if I remove yeah. this. There he goes, and then he's stuck again. He doesn't understand that he can't move in between. The fences. Oh, and have you seen any news about 1.14? I have seen news. I, I've actually been up on the news very closely. Because what? were you aware? Like, you know this? Oh yes. <laughs> 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 yes, I was aware. That's I love that. <laughs> this looks stupid. Like you can stand um, normally under it as well, so you can kind of move. Yeah, I know. It's so much fun. Um, hey, here's stuff for an axe. Oh, nice. Thank you. I will go and continue to work on the wall instead of messing around. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta mess around a little bit. That's what half the fun is playing together. That's true. 
That is very true. I will work and now play my Jackie Double Boy. As Skizzleman says, I'm gonna make myself some paste pants right now too. Peace pants? Peace pants. Oh. <laughs> peace pants. The pants you wear to cause peace between other players. In a democratic. No, wait, what? Um, I'm taking this down, by the way, because I, I, I'd run into our base, like, <laughs> trying to run away from a mob and hit that thing. <laughs> well, he wouldn't be able to reach you. Well. The creeper would absolutely be able to kill me. Ah, <laughs> uh, true. <laughs> what do you gotta bring logic that, into this? The creeper flaw. <laughs> what do you have to bring logic into the, into a discussion about? Yeah. Derping up. I'm, well, I, I will find a way to make that kill me, to make new game mechanics kill me before I figure out really how to use them. I was, um, I, I, the whole new villager breeding system and stuff is going to be fascinating. I'm, I'm very excited to get into trading. Yeah, that's going to be super fun. And actually, do you know when, when they, when you upgrade from 113 to 114, do all your villagers turn into types or do they stay the classic? I brought my single player world into the 13A, I think. Mm-hmm. And they changed skin, but they kept all of their trades. Got it. Because that was what I was, you know, you know, in craft theory, we have that trading docks. Yeah. It would be interesting, but uh, I guess we'll have, to, we'll have to have the new trading docks, right? Oh, by the way, you said you had saddles? Yeah, I have two saddles. I forgot to... There are two horses over here. Well, let's tame them on it. Where are you at? I am, I guess I'm, what, east of the village? East. Okay. Far side from the wall. Best friends forever! I'm I'll let you tame the other one so you can get the advancement too. Yay. Let's see. I'm on my way. Uh, are you up on the hill? Nope. Um over like in where the it kind of where it goes furthest west kind of in the u shape of the map. a little north and west oh i see a horse yeah i'm there cutting down all the trees over here try so to keep more stuff, stuff for the wall there you go Nope. Love me. Love me. Love me. I have a horsey. There we go. Now she loves me. This is Opona. Oh, she's she's not Opona. She's slow. Yeah, you want to see? You want to race? Ready? You're, okay. Set. Oh. oh, yeah, I picked the faster horse. <laughs> you smart man. <laughs> Lucky man, because I did not. I was not on purpose. Oh, look, perfect place to leave our horses. You could just take out these corner blocks. No, 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 buddy. Oh, oh, I hit your horse by accident. I don't think it was accident, sir. I was digging up. I love how the... It, does the saddle look different to you, or is it the resource yeah, that I'm using? Yeah, it does. No, no, it looks different in vanilla, too. Yeah, for my viewers, I don't know if I said it in the... Oh, creeper behind you! <laughs> I fell down and right behind the creeper, and he was... That was funny, because I knew you were behind me. I would never have turned around for the footsteps. So, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> but, uh, I don't know if I said in the first clip where we died. 
uh, or if I actually set it in the one we use. But I'm using a resource pack from uh, Thwip. He's an awesome content creator. If you like, if you viewer and you John don't know about him, definitely go and check him out because he's amazing at building. I don't think I've ever seen some of his content. I've seen other people that use his. So I will definitely do that. Getting some more iron for us and lots and lots more coal, so we'll have unlimited torches. Um, I also got more wood. Do you need that to keep working on the wall, or do you want some help on the wall? Um, a little bit of help would probably be good. Let me just finish mining up this coal here, and I'll be right with you. Awesome. All right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Oh, I'm out of oak wood. That's why I stopped earlier. Oh, it's dark out. Oh, yeah, it's dark. It's nighttime. Should we ride patrol on our horses? Or maybe that'll be tomorrow. Uh, I'm not sure. I, I just know I, I really want this wall. I don't care if it doesn't wrap around the whole village, but I just want it. <laughs> I don't think we're going to be able to finish the whole wall. Here's, there's, um, I'm putting... Here, that you have much, much more. I'll, I'll do the cutting down uh, and processing of the uh, wood. Did you get the wood I threw in the ground behind you? Yeah. Okay. You go back to building, and I will keep working on this stuff. No, 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 no. Okay, good. Uh, got the creeper. There we go. All right. Yeah, I've got I've got a little bone meal and stuff. Should be able to speed this stuff up. I'm not sure I like that the iron golem is just wandering away from the village. Where is it? He's um down the south of the wall. You should, you should pay more attention as our deputy. Gotta fire that deputy. I'm not sure that I like that the trees drop sticks now. I really love that. Do you? Yeah. So many drops. It does it? Does it? It doesn't reduce the sapling drop, does it? No. Okay. Because that would annoy me. Uh, the reason I love it is because it makes it so much easier uh, for stuff. You don't need to waste wood to get sticks. Ow. Wow, you're making a big wall. Yeah, it's supposed to wrap the whole village, but I don't... <laughs> I'm not sure if we're gonna have the time. Do you have... here, do you want more wood? I am uh, out of stairs. I have more wood. Oh, here you go. Oh. Oh, good. Awesome. I'm gonna go Thank you. kill these guys and lay it up more to the south here. As you're building this direction, it's gonna get dangerous. <laughs> it is. Uh, what I would like is if we could light up each of these acacia pillars. Okay. In the outside or the inside? Uh, on the inside. The outside isn't that important. Well, we do every other one. And the top is going to be spawn-proof. Because stairs and then slabs on top of the oak. So nothing can spawn on top of there and drop down on us. 
Yep. I went with every other one on this, this section, section down here. I think that's the right spacing. Uh, what did you say? I said I went with every other uh, pillar. Yep. Down here. As long as it lights up and makes sure that nothing yeah, can spawn. Yeah, it, it makes it spawn roof. It, it gets it down to a level eight or above. That's the most important part. So many mobs. Yep. I've gotten to the point where I uh, kind of ignore every other type of mob as long as they leave me alone, except for zombies. Okay, this guy's gonna kill me. No. Oh, how did he hit you? Thank there you. The bow meal is what you really wanted out of that anyway. got the bones. Yeah. Oh, he's after you. Okay. Yeah. That makes it a bit easier, to be honest. Like, if we could get this uh, creepers to lock onto one of us, and then the other just goes for him. We'll just do that. And let them... <laughs> I'm like, you're talking about this, and then all of a sudden I hear boom. <laughs> <laughs> This corner that you're about to go work in is all lit up now. Awesome. Throw down a few more trees down there. Kind of forgot to keep on placing the slabs because I were I, I dropped it and were like save down. Can I think maybe that house needs to be within the walls. Like, I can't leave any of the houses outside. No, we definitely have to wall in the houses. But the wall can go diagonal, right? Or it'd be hard, this design. Whoa, you okay? Yeah. Just took a little bit of damage. Where'd he come from? Underneath. There we go. Okay, Sheriff, Sheriff says no. A creeper doesn't care what the sheriff says, because a creeper doesn't speak human. Well, the skeleton does. And you better care, because Sheriff said no. <laughs> Stupid spider, arachne, do not kill me. You hear me? So Two many skellies over here. Three, Three skellies and a creeper. This is gonna be fun. Shoot. Well, no, no, not you. Get, get your buddy, buddy over here. Four skellies and a creeper. How about go for a record? <laughs> and let's see. Oh, yeah, food. I go to the crafting table to craft bread, and then I forget what I'm supposed to craft. I like the skellies because they give you bone. Yeah. Which we can turn into trees. Is that you? Yeah. Oh, it's morning. Not, not yet. They're not burning. Uh, he was. <laughs> All right. So we made it through another day, Dennessy. Woo. Should we uh, take a quick break here? Uh, I think so. Get somewhere safe. Why don't we come down to the, come down to the village here by this lone tree? I need to finish. I will. Uh... Oh, I'm out of slabs. Okay. I will 
Makes the daylight signs go false. Boom. Whoop. And we'll say see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed it so far. And uh, if you enjoyed, you know what to do. Thank you for watching. I hate it. Bye, guys. <laughs>